In this video, you're going to learn about the discounts and coupons section. We're going to learn about buy one, get one free. First, click on the name of the site you're working on. Next, click on Modules. Then click on the e-commerce module. Scroll down and click on Global Discounts and Coupons. You first need to create your coupon and then you will add your discount after it. Click on Add Coupon. First you give your coupon a name. You can also give your coupon a brief description. Checking this box will override any global discounts you have set up. This is where you set a date and a year for this coupon to expire. This shows you the times used and how many times it can be used. When you set up a coupon such as this, you can come back here often and check to see how many times it's been used. The first number, zero with the slash, represents how many times it's been used. This number represents how many times it can be used. For this particular coupon, once five people have used it, it will no longer be valid. Scroll down and click Save when you're done. Now that we've added the coupon, we need to add the discount. Click on Add Discount. First, we give the discount a name. Next, you can configure the Use Conditions. Here you'll see Apply when order total is between, and it's asking you for the dollar amounts. Here you'll see it's asking you to apply to which buyers and which groups. Select from the drop-down and click on the one you want. This is where you select whether this coupon is applied if a particular item is purchased or not. This section deals with the discount types. Is it a per order discount or a per item? If it were per order, you would put in the amount of the discount, either percent or a dollar sign here. You can also select the box below to show this as a separate invoice item. If this were a per item discount, you would set those options here. Apply to, you have to select which items this applies to. Ranges by, you have to select what it ranges by. You can also choose to have a shipping discount by selecting from the drop down. This is where you would select if they get any shipping discount for these items. If you select free shipping for selected items, you then select the word select underneath to choose which items. Check the box next to any category this applies to. At the top you'll see you can select it from the category or from products. If you check the box at the top that says products, it will show products instead of categories. Click apply when you're done. This section deals with your volume discounts, such as buy one, get one free. You'll see here I'm doing a buy one, get any of the selected items by clicking on select. This time we're going to select products at the top. Scroll down and put a check in the box next to the item. 
So now we've said buy one skyline photo. And we're saying get one of this other item for free. Now we're going to click on select and choose what the other item is. Let's select products again. Scroll down and select the other item. Click apply when you're done. This area is asking us what percent or dollar amount to every how many items. This is asking us what does this apply to. And here you can choose to count different items separately or together. When you're done, scroll down and click Save. Next, we're going to take a look at our coupon. Here you'll see I added a Skyline photo to the shopping cart, and it's giving me the bird photo for free. Your buyer would simply click checkout when they were done.